Hey guys, it's Megan. Thanks for coming back to my channel, or if you're new here, welcome to my channel. Like and subscribe down below if you want to, and the socials are down there as well if you wanna look at those. So today, I'm going to be doing a pack with me slash some road trip tips. So the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do if you're going on a road trip or any sort of trip is have a packing list. That is so, so important. It keeps me organized and honestly gets me a little excited for my trip too. So I'll show you guys mine. This is what mine looks like. I don't know if you can see that, um, but I just use my iPad and it's pretty lengthy, not gonna lie. Probably won't take everything, but this just helps me organize and not forget anything. The next thing you can do is download your route or just your map in general. So I do this on Google Maps. That's the one that I use um, and it lets you download them. So if you don't have any service, there's no problem with that. You can still get to your route um, and get to your spot and there's no problems. The next thing you're gonna wanna do is clean your car completely. We got a car wash, we went through that, and then we used the free vacuum and like the wipe down. So we wiped down the car, got all the dust gone, vacuumed the entire thing so the car is completely clean now and ready to go. To have your playlist ready and make sure it's downloaded as well. Because when you're going through the mountains or just little places that you might not have service, having your playlist downloaded is going to be awesome because then you won't have any service interruptions and you'll be going great listening to your music. And the last tip I have for you guys is to have a carry-on, whether that's a purse, a tote, a bag, a backpack, whatever that is, if you're flying or if you're driving, you always wanna have something in the back or next to your seat that you can just pick up, get some gum out, get some medicine out, get your charger out, whatever you need, just so you don't have to go all the way back and into your suitcase, because sometimes, especially on planes, you can't really do that. And that is all the tips and tricks that I have for you guys, so let's get into packing. Okay, so I just did my laundry and it's all right here. This giant pile of clothes and then this giant pile of socks and underwear. So I'm kind of just gonna grab everything out and we'll go from there. So like I said, I have my list here. I already got some socks and my swimsuit so I crossed those off and I'm going to be thinking about and making my outfits. Alrighty, so this is what my floor looks like now. I got my bag over there and then clothes just all over the floor. So let's organize this. Alrighty, so here are all my clothes that I'm going to bring. And then I have two still down here because I don't know which sweatpants I want to take. But right here, I'm just bringing two different sweatshirts because I've only been feeling for five days. I don't need to bring more than that. And I have a rain jacket slash pullover. And then I have a white tank top, a like a cute blouse thing, a Nike tank top, and then these are just shirts that I can wear with jeans or anything like that. And I have a dress and then my cardigan for church and I can wear that cardigan any other time. And then I just have some jean shorts, white Nike shorts, black Nike shorts, and then the nice gray ones. And then of course, swimsuit, underwear, socks, all that. And then these are like half sweatpants and then one pair of black leggings and then two pairs of jeans. I'm debating on bringing just one, but I'm still not sure. So that is all the clothes that I'm bringing. Right, now I'm just gonna go through and check off my list. Okay, so I got all the clothes and stuff. Now I'm going to pick my shoes and then go from there. Guys, it's Megan, I'm back. So I was with you guys packing all my clothes and stuff on Tuesday and now it is Thursday. I'm leaving in an hour, so I need to finish packing and I think I'm going to start with all my technology. Alrighty, so this is all of my technology. We have all the different chargers here. I have a phone charger, another phone charger, AirPod Pros, iPad charger, laptop charger, and my Apple Watch charger, and then a laptop and the iPad with the Apple Pencil. And this is all I'm bringing for technology. All right, now that I have all my technology and in my backpack and everything, I'm going to grab all of my shoes. The shoes that I'm bringing, these are just my old Nike shoes that 
I can get dirty and I won't freak out. Um, some dress shoes for church. And then these are what I'm going to be wearing for the most of the trip. Just my chacos. And yeah, that's what I'm bringing for shoes. Fred is going to be trying to get and fit all of my toiletries into a couple bags and into my big backpack. So this is all the makeup and toiletries that I'm bringing. So we have the highlighter, contour, blush, um, concealer, foundation. Um, I only have two makeup brushes. I'm gross. I know. Sorry. A spoolie for my eyebrows and eyelashes. And then we have the um, matte finish. Um, this is for my eyebrows. And sometimes if I want to like go on a trip, I'll just bring that instead of my big James, pa James Charles palette. And then my ugly, nasty, old beauty blender. Neosporin for my piercings, and then of course deodorant, eyelash curler, tweezers, mascara, and then my favorite hair clip, and then some Q-tips, and then a razor. Alright, so now this is the rest of this stuff that I have to find a place for. Just like vitamins, toothbrush, like I don't have a toiletry bag, I just have a small makeup bag. And it's honestly sad, but I think I'm just gonna shove it all in my duffel. So now that everything is in there, the only last few things I have is my purse, some books that I want to read, my Bible, my water bottle, and my wallet. So let's go ahead and put those in. Alrighty guys, well I finished my list and I finished packing. Here are my suitcases and stuff. But I literally just have my backpack and then my duffel bag here. Alright, and this is what the back of the car looks like with all of our stuff in there. I have three pairs of shoes that I'm probably just going to put in the bag or like put it in the back of the car because I don't have any place to put them in my backpack or in my duffel. So I finished the list on my iPad, got everything done, everything is checked off and we are ready to go i'm so excited well thank you guys so much for tuning in to my channel this week to watch this video i had so much fun filming it as you guys can tell i get excited about the littlest things honestly <laughs> like and subscribe if you want to and i'll see you guys in the next video bye